This is the Onion News Network. Not watching is an act of defiance. Tensions with North Korea continued to mount today after the rogue nation destroyed the entire continent of Asia, and a move analysts say could affect the diplomatic climate in the region. According to the Pentagon, the impact of detonating nuclear weapons across the continent on the already strained relations between North Korea and the rest of Asia remains to be seen. We strongly condemn uh, North Korea's decision to uh, murder four billion innocent people. The president has stated that he is personally disappointed and we'll bring this issue up with the surviving members of the G8 at their next conference. Expunging 95% of life from the Asian continent is a clear rejection of the six-party talks that Secretary of State Hillary Clinton recently proposed. Chinese President Hu Jintao has yet to speak out about the attack, continuing a long pattern of his nation's inaction toward North Korean saber-rattling. Further complicating things are North Korea's ambiguous statements to the Western media. We have now destroyed Asia. Europe is next, with missiles to be launched this coming Thursday, then North and South America in April. It's been reported that North Korea still possesses dozens more nuclear warheads, something that will certainly come up when the UN Security Council meets next month.